J. Cole, real ice cold water ice J. Cole, he's cold as the ice, real cold world, J. Cole, listen, bruh, J. Cole by far, you can't doubt it, you can't deny it, right now he's the best rapper, he's by far ahead of Kendrick Lamar and Drake right now, it's not, it's not even funny, and by the way, Kendrick Lamar of all time, he's definitely better than J. Cole, and... I don't think Jekko will ever be at a point of Kendrick Lamar was on. Like, especially like 2015 to Pimp a era. Mm. Now, Kendrick Lamar was nasty that era. He was nasty. But I'm talking about right now. Of all time, obviously, Kendrick Lamar. But right now, Jekko is far ahead of Drake and uh, Kendrick Lamar. Because... J, J. Cole right now is in like end of an era. He's gearing up for his final album, the All Season. And ever since like ever since the I mean the, the fall off, he's gearing up for his final album, the fall off. And ever since the off season, bro, J. Cole has been in a different type of zone. Like he's been everywhere, not just his own personal music but features as well he's been going in on the features look at what he did with benny the butcher's song like oh my goodness like he's no f and look at what he did on little yardies he's giving a hundred percent not only to his own work but the features as well he's on a crazy run and all of these features he's doing they're just like warm-ups gear ups to get us ready for the fall off where it will be uh, like he will be his magnus opus like everything he's giving everything to the fall off everything we've heard since like no everything since kod has been lead that's what jacko said every everything since kod has been leading to the fall off he's hyping this up literally the off season you thought the off season was phenomenal by the way the off season is better than Drake's recent album and Kendrick's recent album. That's why I say he's better because his recent out. Look, if we look at their recent albums, J. Cole by far the off season. It's better than Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. It's better. Like if you look at production wise, beats, J. Cole was rapping better than Kendrick. He was yes, yes, absolutely. He was. Production, he had it over Kendrick. Yes. Yes, and obviously they have it over Drake because Certified Lover Boy is kind of mid. Like, let's be honest. I mean, not Certified Lover Boy. Um, for all the dogs, mid. Like, I'm. That's what I'm saying. If we look at their recent works right now, Jayco is in a different zone. He's so far ahead of them. It's not even funny. Like, where because and you have to look at this. Like, Kendrick Lamar has already reached the top. Like, everyone considered. Out of those three, everyone considers him the number one. And Drake as well, he's considered number one in his own category in terms of selling the most. But no one ever puts J. Cole as that number one. And J. Cole right now, bro, he's in the zone when he wants that top spot. Right now, he's in the zone where it's his time right now. It's his time. Like, Everyone else can get out of the way because it's J. Cole's time right now. That's the zone he's in. He wants that throne. He wants the title. He wants to be number one. He doesn't want that second, third place. He wants number one. He wants his magnum opus. Literally. Like, listen. Bro, I'm telling you right now. J. Cole, once the fall off comes off, once the fall off drops, bro. Dude, dude, because everything, like, the off-season is supposed to be, like, a little, like, side thing to the fall-off. And the off-season is phenomenal, bruh, I can't, yo, the fall-off, dude, nah, J. J Cole, Jermaine Cole, Real Ice Cold Water World, J. Cole, Ooh, wee, that nigga's in a different zone.